Hi, um, today I'm going to show you how to order Uber online uh, without a smartphone. Um, first, you set your browser to go to m.uber.com. Um, that is assuming you have an account with Uber already. Um, when you go to put in your sign-in information, here and enter a password. If you enter it wrong, you'll get this network error thing. Um, I've been hearing a lot of people saying I keep getting network error, network error. That might be because they haven't gotten permission from Uber to use this site. Um, I never got permission and it works for me. I don't can't tell you why, but um, that would be my first suggestion if you do put the right information in and um, the right password, and you still get that network error, then I would call, um, email them and ask for permission to use this site. Um, but if you just want to try and see if it works, go ahead. Um, I'm going to pause this and enter my information, and I'll be right back. Okay, um, so I'm using Chrome. I'm logged in now, and um, I'm not seeing any pop up saying allow location but when I use Firefox I tend to see this pop up saying allow location and I just click yes. Um, it should possibly just go right to your home if it knows where that is. At least it does for me. I'm not this is not my home because I'm using it somewhere else. But um, for me it usually starts right at my home. Um, I'm way out in the boonies here, and it's telling me it's 10 minutes, so let's go in towards Portland. Uh, you can see here, um, there's a car, there's a car. Okay, let's say I'm at the Japanese garden. I'm a tourist here, and I have my laptop for some reason at the Japanese garden. <laughs> but yeah, that's a problem. Um, you can use a computer to get to your place, but then if you don't have a computer at your place, you might not be able to order an Uber to get back, but um, this is also good for ordering a rides for people that you know that you want them to come to visit you, or um, a lot of other reasons that you don't like. You don't have a smartphone with you, or don't even own one. Um, so, assuming you've gotten this far and not got hooked, um, caught up, um, you can look down here. Um, this is very similar to the app. You can slide it to the different kinds of services. Uh, in Portland, we have these services and other um, places. They have other services. Uh, UberX is the cheapest. So if I click Set Pickup Location, uh, it'll pop up. And right now it's surging, so it's a little higher than normal. And it, I'll say, Yeah, sure, that's fine. Or if you don't want to do the surge, you can wait a little while. Um, um, if I have a promo code, I guess I haven't used one before, I can add it there. Um, make sure to use PDX19 uh, and you get your first ride for $15 off. Um, then when you're ready to go, you just click request and be really, really ready because it will show up right away, usually within a few minutes. So. Um, right now it says five minutes and they actually mean it um, almost always are they there on that amount of time. So I hope this helps um, people be able to order Uber online. If not, um, you can contact me and with your problems or um, try to contact Uber support. If you do contact Uber support, just be persistent. Just ask the question over and over again until you get the answer.